Hey guys, back with another video, and this time we've got another overview, and this is going to be of a new Invicta that we picked up here at CWWHQ. Um, we've got it in two different color tones to show you, just so you can get an idea of what each is like. It's called the Invicta Specialty Infinity, and you can see here we've got it in black and rose gold, and then we've also got it in black and blue. And I love, love, love this watch. Let me take this off to show you. Move that out of the way. Up close and personal. It is 44 millimeters in case diameter, which I think is just a perfect size. Again, kind of that sweet spot that I like so much. Here it is on my wrist, and you can see, I mean, it's got nice, you know, proportion to the wrist, not super huge, but still big enough to kind of give you what you need. Um, case thickness, I think we're sitting at about 12 and a half millimeters. So again, really nice flush to the wrist, but you do have some height here, which is cool. Eight and a half in bracelet length for you. So you've got a good amount of room there to groove and of course some links that you can take out if you need to. Um, you've got 20 millimeters in lug width. So if you do want to change out the strap, maybe add a NATO to it, maybe a leather, you can definitely do that if you wanted to. Not too bad in terms of weight either. We're talking about six ounces here, so pretty decent. Like it. What else? Uh, you got water resistance, 165 feet. That's about five ATM. Look at the blue on that. Isn't that pretty? I'm just looking at my monitor to make sure you guys can see what I'm seeing. But that blue is stunning, and it's not quite the Invicta blue that Invicta is famous for, but it's a stunning blue nonetheless. I love that. I love how it shines, picks up the light. And this is a fixed bezel. It's not going anywhere on you. Pretty cool. Now let's talk about the movement. I'm going to actually pick up that, that rose gold one because I want to show that baby off too. Make sure I can get this back on the right way. I never can. I never can. Let's see how that works. Hopefully you guys can see that. All right, let me pick up this rose gold one. This one's mine. The blue one is actually David called shotgun on that one. Look at the rose gold. Whew. Hello, gorgeous. Show you this one on too. I love this one. I love the black and the rose gold. I just think that is so classy and so elegant. Oh. Gorgeous. All right, so let's talk about the movement on this. You've got a Japanese TMI PC21. It's a quartz, so it's going to take a battery, which is nice. You've got a push-pull crown. I'm going to get it in real tight to show you that. And you can see you've got some cool little grooves on the crown. You see those? Just a cool little detail. And then you've got the deployant clasp. You know, the standard does that, click it, boom, done. I think it's got, yeah, it's got the Invicta logo here. You can see, love that, very cool. And then you've got the Invicta up at the 12 o'clock too. Make sure you can see that. Tricky with this lighting, I tell ya. I love the Roman numerals too. And then of course on the hour and minute markers, you've got the trip night accents, which is cool. And then, kind of that minimalist design, you know, there's not a whole lot going on with it, but it's still really classy. You know, it's got that kind of elegant feel to it. It almost has kind of a vintage feel to it without really being a vintage style watch, but it just kind of reminds me of like the old school, you know, kind of very basic, very minimal watch designs of times before. How profound was that? <laughs> so I love that look. I just think that's really pretty. You've got the Roman numerals. I don't know if I mentioned that, but I love those. Very cool. And then the thing that I kind of like about it is it's, it's something that you can dress up, you can dress down. David has worn his the blue and black. He's worn it with jeans and a t-shirt, but again, it's kind of one of those that you can really dress up um, 
if you wanted to, if you wanted to wear it with a suit or maybe a nice shirt and some slacks, guys, you could do that. And again, I think that size, that 44 millimeters, it's really kind of spot on for either women or men. I mean, and you can see in relation to, um, to my wrist, it's not, it's not overwhelming. <clears throat> it's not taking up too much space. I can still stack some bracelets on either side if I wanted to, kind of amp it up a little bit, bling it out. Um, how cool would this look with some black and rose gold bracelets? I mean, hello, wicked. Love that. So for me, this is kind of, you know, this is kind of what, you know what this watch is? A lot of us have so many watches that are full of bells and whistles. You've got JMT, you've got, you know, chronograph, you've got cables, you've got all kinds of stuff on your watch, but you don't have a watch that's just kind of basic. It's just very minimalist. There's not a whole lot going on here. You just really, what stands out is the blue or the rose gold. I think they've got a yellow gold version as well. I'll link all the information below for you guys if you're interested, but this is just one of those watches that, again, it's just it's minimal, but it's still that statement piece that we're looking for. And a lot of us don't have just kind of a basic dressy watch within our watch collection. And I think this one could really be that nice addition to your watch collection. And you don't have to go with the rose gold. You see how cool this blue one looks. I mean, this is, this is all class right here. This is absolutely beautiful. And that blue is unlike any other blue that I've ever seen, certainly within the Invicta line. It's not kind of that Invicta blue that they're known for. And then against that kind of black, even though it sort of looks gray, uh, almost gunmetal-ish. I mean, this is, again, just one of those very versatile watches that you can wear, like I said, with jeans and a t-shirt, but you can definitely dress it up. This, for me, I mean, this is like elegant. And how on trend right now is rose gold. Everyone wants a rose gold piece in their wardrobe, whether it's jewelry, whether it's your watches, earrings, ladies, this is so on point for us right now. And fellas too, I think this looks so good on guys. So, I mean, you've got yourself a real stunner with this piece. So again, this is the Invicta Specialty Infinity. We've got it in the black and rose gold, which you can see here. And then we've also got it in the black and blue is what they're calling it. But I feel like it's a little more gunmetally gray. Whatever. <laughs> 44 millimeters in case diameter. So nice, good, I'm trying to avoid thumbprints here, fingerprints, nice, good, median size in terms of case diameter. Again, 12 and a half millimeters in case thickness. So just a really nice height, doesn't sit too high, doesn't sit too low. It's not, you know, flush by any means, but definitely some good height there. You've got eight and a half here on the bracelet. Let me get in there and show you that too. I mean, hello, look at that. Look how it catches the light too, isn't that stunning? Love it. And then a good look at that crown again. Love this. this is so pretty. Oh, I could just stare at it all day. Uh, stainless steel. Oh, I didn't mention the crystal is the flame fusion crystal. Very nice and durable. Looks good. I just love how it catches the light there. And then you've got the Japanese TMI PC21 quartz movement. Fixed bezel, push pull crown. Simple, simple. Again, just an easy, minimalist watch. Not a whole lot of bells and whistles here. It really just is beautiful. It's, it's, for me, it's just kind of one of those pieces you want to look at because it's just so gorgeous. And I love, love, love the Roman numerals. I think that's so pretty. You can see them there. So this is definitely one I think you should pick up. And right now, I was looking this morning um, on Shop HQ's website and they've got it on sale now, I think for right around $80, maybe like 77 bucks. So, I mean, this is like a steal if you wanna pick this up, especially if you're looking for a rose gold piece to add to your collection. I mean, come on, definitely worth checking out. If you want to pick up these things, just give me one heck of a time, I tell ya. My husband always laughs at me. He's like, I swear. <laughs> this woman. So. There you go, the rose gold 
and then you've got this blue. I mean, these are just love them. Like I said, 77 bucks on Shop HQ right now. Of course, that's subject to change as we publish this video. We all know Shop HQ things change kind of daily, sometimes hourly, um, but make sure to link that information down below for you guys if you're interested. Um, what else did I want to tell you about this? Anything? I think I covered it. Pretty good. Not bad at all. Um, as always, if you like the video, please give us a thumbs up. We appreciate that. If you haven't already, make sure to click the subscribe button so that you can always get caught up on our latest videos. Um, and of course, this will be posted on our website too, chickswithwatches.com. You can check out all kinds of amazing watch porn there too if you're interested. Thanks you guys for stopping by. Till next time.